friends in this tutorial we will see how to manage widgets of our wordpress website so basically widgets are used for enhancing our website without knowing any technology so uh, you uh, you can see this area this area is known as sidebar or widget ready area so in this you can see archive search bar recent comments meta and recent post these all are widgets and by default they are present in our web website so you can change them or manage them so for changing or adding or removing them you can go to dashboard then click on appearance then widgets so basically there are two columns in this widget section so firstly known as available widgets so you can see list of all available widgets over there now in second column you can see the location where you can um, save or show you want to show your widgets so basically you can uh, add or remove them or update them so for removing these widgets you can simply click on this arrow button and click on this delete and second method to remove them is simply drag them and place over here drag and drop drag and drop so for this firstly we will open this website parallelly see so now to view change remove one more widget custom command drag and drop it over here refresh now as you can see that command section also have been removed now if you want to add different uh, widget over there then you can simply drag this and place in this section now suppose you can give a title to this widget calendar and save now again refresh that page and you can see calendar over there now suppose you want to add a image or a video this can also be done by using widgets now suppose you want to add image then click on this image section and as you can see that primary widget area this is a second way of adding widget to a area you can select area and then add widget then widget can automatically be added to this section or you can drag or drop like this so we need one section so delete one now give us my wordpress now select image by clicking on that add image button you can upload image or you can select either from your media library section now you can click on this button suppose if you want to link this image to a particular url then you can add that url also then click on link to url and you can insert your link here suppose i want to link this image with my youtube video this now click on add to widget now save and refresh this page now here you can see the logo and when you click on this this automatically redirects to you you do video now next suppose we want to insert a video now you can see here a video widget you can drag and drop it over there and write a title and add video now there is no need to add 
uh, upload this video you can directly insert from URL now paste your video URL here and add to widget as you can see here your video has been placed in this section now click on save now go to website and refresh that page you can see here your video you can play or post it okay now second now we can see how to remove them suppose if you want to remove them then you simply click on delete button now see here this the video has been gone now simply you can delete all widgets see now if you want to insert any new widget then you can also insert new widget by using this section plugins for plugins you can watch my previous tutorial now add new suppose we want to have a text editor in which you can add images and text below that image then you can uh, use a text editor for this now by default there is a text editor let us see it before go to widgets now if you drag and drop simple text widget then you can see there is no option for adding image or video nothing so for adding image or video you um, you can have a new plugin so for installing a new plugin or a widget click on plugin then add new then right here black as you can see here black studio tiny mce widget now click on install and activate that plugin now again go to widget section appearance then widgets you can see here a visual editor black studio tiny mce widget now drag and drop it over here now as you can see that there is an option for adding media add title to, to this now insert image and you can reduce its size according to your requirement tutorial now click on save now refresh that page you can see here so if you want to add both image or text or links to that text then you can use black tiny mce widget similarly you can add number of widgets in your uh, widgets area by using plugins now there are di different locations where you can save your widgets suppose you want to show your widget over this area then you drag the Im image widget or any 
or any widget you want to add then click on add image then right here first photo widget Sorry. and click on save now see the difference refresh see this is our first footer area similarly you can add you uh, you can add any of the widget in different area suppose you want to add pages to second footer area add widget now see the difference see this is our second footer area similarly you can add meta to third footer area it's not necessary that you can uh, you add these plugin which i'm i'm adding you can add any plugin accord according to your requirement any widget according to your requirement see here similarly you can add number of widgets according to your requirement in your required section similarly on fourth footer area hello friends i'm going to Now click on save and refresh this page. Here, this is your fourth widget section. Similarly, you can add any number of widgets you want, or you can remove according to your requirement. You can add new widgets by installing them from plugin section. In this way, you can increase or enhance your website presentation or look. Now there is one left region known as secondary area you can also drag and drop one widget over here and see the difference now secondary footer area lies just below the primary primary area primary sidebar sorry this area secondary widget area secondary widget area just lie below the primary widget area as you can see here so in this way you can add widgets you can remove widgets or you can install new widgets from plugins thanks for watching and do not forget to subscribe like and or comment bye bye